Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another episode of Crazy Craft. Today is almost Christmas. This should be going up Christmas Eve, which for you guys that celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to everyone else who does and does not as well. But over here, I found this while I was walking around. I want to see who sent me this. They gave me a little reindeer. It looks like Santa's coming in and down. Wait, is this wool? What is this? Is this actually wool? I don't know what that is. Merry Christmas from Elfberry Jam. Oh, this is so cute. This is actually like awesome looking as well. Whoever made this was the, like an awesome job. Did I do that? Did I make that portal? <laughs> I don't remember ever making that portal. But this looks awesome. I want to know what block this. Is. I should have known that was gonna happen. I should have known that it was Strawberry Jam, and something was gonna explode. I, I should have I should have just figured that. I really should have. <laughs> that was actually really good. Oh, hey, what's this? Gift sack? We're in a block right now. That's weird. We have a gift sack here. I don't know where I got this from. I'm going to press R, though. Your inventory is full. All right, let's dump out some of this stuff. I have no idea what this is going to be, but let's get rid of this stuff on my hot bar. <gasps> we got a mini mannequin. <gasps> Look at how cute I am. <gasps> Oh, look at me. I, I want to carry this guy around with me at all times. It's like I'm just carrying around a little doll with me. It's like little me. Oh, it's so much. It's, so, it's just staring at me. I need him to be on my hot bar at all time. He's so adorable. So what I want to do is I want to make a giant tree at spawn. Or maybe not a giant tree. I want to see. Let's let's look up like sapling or trees or something. A tree. What happens when we look up tree? Probably nothing. Let's look up saplings and see if there's any... Uh, saplings in here that might be cool to try out um, that we could make like a Christmas tree or something like that coconut sapling I didn't know banana saplings. I know we could get like any of this. I'm sorry. You guys cannot see this. I apologize um, <laughs> Now that I'm thinking about it. I'll move the webcam over to the left side for this episode I'm gonna start doing that for crazy craft. I think It'll start being on the left side. So if it's already like that, I apologize. Um, but if that I didn't mention it beforehand. Um, but there's not much stuff that probably does like experience tree. I think would be cool to have at spawn. But let's go see if anyone's done anything at spawn for Christmas. I doubt that there has been. Um, but let's see. We could put one here. We could probably get rid of this Thanksgiving one, uh, and then do something else with it. Uh, yeah, I don't see anything for Christmas around here. So maybe we should put like a little experience tree around here. Get some gifts around. I'm going to take down all of this as well. Just get rid of it. I wish I had an axe on me. Wait, do I? Hold on, let me finish this. Axe? Axe? No, I don't have an axe. Let's break all of you guys as well. I'm going to hold on to these dudes just in case I end up needing them in the future. But come to me. I should probably... Yeah, I don't have enough inventory space. So I'm going to take down all of this stuff. And we're going to make a little Christmas here. A Christmas area on the cube. Or the... the, the not the cube. <laughs> the crazy craft server. So I will be back, guys. Hold on. Alright, guys. We're back. And I've been cleaning up this place a little bit. I've actually... Like, if you guys saw beforehand, there was a ton of holes around here. I've been just putting them in. I actually used seven stacks of grass. Um, and there's still a lot more like there's over here a little bit over here, but I think I'm good for now I just killed two Pac-Man and look what I got. I think this is a sign. Where'd it go? There it is. It's right here I think this is a sign we got the experience tree seed So I think we have to use the experience tree I do like how they look and I think that's like I don't think it looks like a Christmas tree But I think it's up there for as close as we could get it now I wonder if we can use bones. Um, is there a I just killed a skeleton. I don't remember exactly where I think it was over here Maybe he dropped a. he did Conveniently enough perfect. I killed some. Oh, there's another bone just in case we didn't have enough yet Um, so just in case we needed it. We're over here now We should be good to go. Um this I don't know if we could actually use bone meal on we cannot It looks like it's just gonna grow on its own. So this might be a little while, but we have to go look what we're Oh, oh sweet. We have to go look so I want to figure out a way like I want one side of the tree to be naughty and one side of the tree be nice And I want to make like a random generator in here somehow where it's like a 50 50 chance on who you get I want to see if there's a way I could do that. I don't know how plausible that is um, Generator yeah, that's that's gonna come up with some weird stuff That's a item pet apparently group regeneration. No, that's not what we're looking for Um, I there, there's not gonna be a way <laughs> Can we look up decider? <laughs> Decide nope I don't know if there's gonna be a way to make it like 50 50 this is the way you choose other than like command blocks and stuff like that or maybe we could make we could even just do a uh, a dispenser a dispenser and make it like uh, one side be like have paper in there and make it be like one side be ha uh, naughty and one side be nice have the decider just completely decide for you this is weird I wish 
I wish there was a way to do this faster. Um, but let's actually go back home really quick. Hopefully that'll just keep going while we're here. Uh, I need to make an anvil. I don't think I have that in the other things yet. Um, but let's see. Grab you guys. So we should be good. And I think we're just going to need one of these really quick. We're not going to need uh, more than one anvils. It should be, I just like named them twice. So let's put, oh, I do have an anvil back here. Nice. Um, let's grab some paper. We're going to use paper and we're going to do, uh, should I use a book? Like a signed book? No, I'm feeling paper. Let's just do paper. Paper's easy. We'll get a bunch of these. We don't need an absurd amount. We're going to need probably around, yeah, 16 should be good. There's there's not going to be 16 people coming on the server, but 16, just in case someone decides to cheat a little bit and be like, hmm, I don't like what I got. I have to mix this up. So we'll do eight of each one. So you go in there. Naughty. I have, why does this cost 39 levels? Why does that cost 39 levels? It, it costs five level per? Okay, well, I need to go gather up some levels. So I'm going to go work on that really quick, and I will be back. Hold on. That, like, really threw me off. I didn't expect it to be 40 freaking levels. All right, guys, so we're over here at Joe's base. I asked him if he had an XP tree because I really need to get levels. And I've actually never really used an experience tree before, so I'm curious to see what it's like. And the way to get... You can actually see it on the mini map over on the right side. Um, the experience tree will drop you like bottles and stuff like that. I've never really used it to try and get levels. I've always just killed stuff in over time because you don't really need too many levels on Crazy Craft. You kind of get the stuff just like automatically, kind of, if that makes sense. Like it just kind of comes. Like that's that's like you don't need to sit there for hours just like farming skeletons or anything like that. It'll just eventually come. And this is taking so long to go up. I apologize. What what level am I at? I feel like this is, this is definitely on an extreme hills, but we're at level 70 or something around there. So we should be there any second now. Can you go a little bit faster? Do I have the universal? I do. <laughs> this will make my life a little bit easier. Or not. All right. I thought this... Oh, my God. I thought this would be a little bit easier, but no, of course not. All right. Let's go up here. Oh, sweet. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, sweet. So it drops experience. So let's see how much we get from this. I know that it drops bottles as well. At least I thought it did. Is this one broken? This one, is it still dropping stuff or, or nah? There's some experience. It's dropping experience. There's some bottles. We need as much of that as possible. Um, the reason why I have the universal block remover is it, I was on stream and people told me to use it to get rid of the, uh, what is it called? Um, what the hell? I don't know what that is. The uh, reinforced iron bars that was on my pack bent farm. And it does work. It works with that kind of stuff. And it, work, it was amazing. Like, I just had to go around right-clicking stuff. I don't know, like, why it wasn't working for that. The I just ruined one of Joe's, Joe's like, planted areas. I hope he doesn't mind too much. Um, I don't know why I didn't get rid of the other stuff. Maybe it has to be, like, something that you can't get rid of. Like, the reinforced iron bars you're not supposed to be able to break. Like, you can't break it with a pickaxe or anything. So maybe it just works with stuff that you can't do like that. But with uh, other blocks, it just doesn't work. All right, what level are we at? At level 24. So we need to get to level 39 twice. I'm going to be here for the longest freaking time. What is... Did he trap a hobgoblin? <laughs> Who traps a hobgoblin? All right, this is taking way too long. It's not even like dropping anything anymore. So I have to go figure out another way to get experience. All right, guys, we're back. And I want to show you how I got levels. So I randomly started to... Oh, crap. Okay, maybe I'm not going to be... I should be able to show you guys really quick. So what I ended up doing was, since that was going too slow, I just started putting in random dungeons everywhere and just seeing if there was anything that I could get quick XP off. And I found... I got this one. Like, I just spawned up these things, and there's a bunch of nightmare spawners up here. And those things give crazy XP. So I killed one of them, and I went from level zero after uh, name tagging Naughty. I have to do nice still. I went from 0 to 12 after killing one of them. I think it was the big guy still. I don't know if the big guys do more or less. I don't know exactly how that works. Um, but it gives off crazy experience. So if you're looking for experience, try and find that on the random dungeons. It's really, really good. Um, but we're going to throw you in there. And it's nice how it's like right next to my base as well. And we're going to have nice. So now let's go back to spawn. Slash spawn. God, I need to stop. I keep using caps locks. I'm the worst. Uh, does not look like the experience tree. Exp I can't say that word correctly. Experience tree is still growing. I don't know how long this normally takes. It looks like it's it's being like bone mealed away and all that good stuff. So it shouldn't be too much longer, I'm assuming. But what we're going to do is like right about, let's just do it like right here. That seems like a good area. Um, put that down there and we're going to have 
how can I make, I'm just going to do this. We're going to have nice on the left side. No, it's, I want nice on the right side. So the nice stuff will be over on this side once that thing grows. What is that? Oh, is that someone's base? It is someone's base. Okay. I just saw like the windows over here and I got really, <laughs> that was like, that was like an ADHD moment right there. I apologize. <laughs> I saw something shiny and I was like, Ooh, mine. Um, so we're going to have the naughty go over there and they're going to get the nice presents. And then on the left side, if you have been naughty, if the chest has decided you to be naughty, what am I? Nice. I'm going to put that back in there because this is gifts to myself. So I'll, I'll let the others have it. Um, you get to choose random chests. So once this thing goes up, hopefully, uh, we can get all of these going. I'm going to need a bunch of these. I don't know how many I started off with, but yeah. So these are going to be the nice chests. Uh, maybe yeah, that looks good. I don't want to do uh, one with like like a double chest. I just don't. I think someone might accidentally think that they get twice the amount or something like that. So we're just going to keep on going around here. That looks fine. We might need a little... That should be more than enough chests. I can't imagine there being more. Let's actually make it exactly eight, just in case. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow. Did I actually do this right? I didn't count up the chests. I just randomly grabbed an amount. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, I'm a genius. All right. So there's eight on each side, and we're going to get the stuff. So let's go back to home, and we're going to grab a bunch of coal. <laughs> because <laughs> the bad the naughty people are going to get coal for christmas <laughs> i think i think we should just do straight up coal i think we should so let's give them a stack each and just have it kind of be scattered around like crazy boom we'll change that into that and then maybe throw yeah I'm, I'm gonna be crazy i'm just gonna do that for all of them and for the nice people i think we should go slash back what can we do for the nice ones i got an idea I got an idea. Let's do, instead of like uh, just normal gifts and stuff like that, let's empty this out. I don't need the anvil. I don't care enough. Let's grab some lucky blocks. Let's give them lucky blocks. We're not going to give them a certain, oh God. Wait, why is that all I got? Oh, oh, I thought this was 1 million. It's only 1,500. Okay, so let's go down here and let's grab golden apples. Is there any more god apples or am I out of them now? Nope, I have more than enough. <laughs> I'm, I'm good on god apple still to this day i'm still fine so there we go we have a bunch of those in there and let's grab three stacks worth of lucky blocks and what i want to do is instead of just having normal lucky blocks we're going to give them half a stack of incredibly lucky blocks like uh surround them with gold let's see how that works exactly so there we go we have a stack of that and let's go in here so if i press u on you i don't want to fuel I'm pretty sure there's a way that I can like surround you with this thing. Yeah, there we go. So you can surround them and you get plus 100% luck. So we'll do that. Okay. Oh, this is going to take a while. So we'll give each of them three. I think that's a good amount. Three incredibly lucky blocks. I like that idea. So I'm going to go around giving it, uh, giving, putting them in each of them. And once they click, hopefully the experience tree grows as well. Um, once they click what they end up being, like naughty or nice, they go and grab this stuff. I think that's that's a fun idea, right? I think it's a good idea. Let's go back to spawn and let's see if that has grown yet. Please grow. Please. Where, oh, I went the wrong way. Please grow. Nope, still not. So I'm just going to have to sit here and wait. I don't think there's a way to make it go faster. Is there like a watering can? Water. <laughs> watering can? Is it like a freaking Animal Crossing watering can? No. Doesn't look like it. So I'm going to wait a little bit. I'm going to get all this set up and we'll be back. Maybe I could get Joe to try his luck or something like that. So I'll be back, guys. Hold on. All right, guys, we're back and it's just about done. And I'll, I think it is done. Let me rephrase that. It is done. So let's go slash back. And there's something going on with signs that I have to have it on the second level. So look at this. So we have signs here. If I, are we for real right now? Did I just have to go slash home or something? Why wasn't this working before? Okay, there we go. That's what it was doing. It pretty much would just place it and not give me the option to write. And I have no idea why. Maybe... Oh, was it too far? It was too far. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. So when I was placing these, I was I was probably like too far away. Like this one's, I guess, close enough. But I was too far away to write on it. No. Okay, I have no idea why it was doing that. Oh, well. But I had to put them on these black things. The Abyssal Stone. And it doesn't look that ugly, but it's... it's I'd rather it not be there, but whatever. We're going to leave it there. It's not a huge deal. Um, but pretty much, you come over here. Have you been naughty or nice? So it's time to figure that out for me. You go over here if you want the nice gifts. They're all the same. There are three lucky blocks each. They all... I, I think they all have them in there. I'm pretty sure I did that all. Yes. And then these have coal. Th these all each have a stack of coal. They're in different... Like... 
positions and all that stuff, but they all have a stack of coal. So let's see what I've been this year. Have I been naughty or have I been nice? There's a 50-50 chance. There's eight on each of them. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? I don't want, I'm very curious if you guys could hear my family upstairs screaming because we have people over at our house right now. Three, two, one. I've been nice. I've been good. I have been nice. So let's go see what my gift, well, we know what my gift's going to be. We got these three and we, of course, are going to open these on camera. So let's go do these really quick and that'll be the end of the episode. Oh my God, it's lagging. This experience tree actually lagged the game for a while for me because there's a lot of particles that come on. If I didn't have the particles on, it would be pretty nice, honestly. Um, but since these are going to, ah, let's still go back to my home and we'll go a bit away from, oh, why is I must have thrown that on the ground by accident. Um, I don't want to accidentally spawn something at uh, spawn, even though it's not going to be like a king or something. I just don't want to do it by accident. You know, like you, you don't want to be that guy. You don't want to be that guy that accidentally releases a king. Maybe the game thinks the king is 100% lucky worthy. So let's see. You got chainmail. I don't want that. Oh, God. The ants spawn infinitely over here, and I have no idea why. I do have to move bases, I think. Or at least just never come back outside because they keep spawning over there and it's not like oh like 10 of them will spawn no it's like 500 of them will spawn I, I, and it lags the game like crazy and I don't know I don't know what to do with that I might have to get the chunk reset or something so we got chainmail the first time and this time we got and portal frames yes yes that's actually really really good I do have enough end portal frames now but I still like having them what are you what boots are you you are moss scale boots. That's actually pretty good boots, but I do have my uh, Mobzilla scale boots, which is, in my opinion, my the best. A Royal Guardian boots probably protect you more, but Mobzilla, you don't have that annoying falling stuff, so I like it more. But anyways, guys, I hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, be sure to leave a like. I hope you guys have some amazing... Uh, have a happy holiday. Happy holidays. I can't talk. Merry Christmas. All that good stuff. Get out of here. <gasps>